Hello everyone and welcome to this week's healing session. We continue in our Sabbath series since on the day this has been filmed tomorrow is the beginning of summer solstice or other cultures even call it midsummer in the Celtic wheel of the year it's called Lita <laughs> I think I'm pretty close with the pronunciation I looked it up but you know I'm not Celtic so I wouldn't know it for 100% so if the lighting changes and you see all of a sudden sun rays all over my face I have the blinds down it is a, another exceptionally hot day uh, I'm just gonna suffer through it <laughs> during this video I had the whole morning my fan on and it still was way too hot so <laughs> but I mean it's summer I can't complain uh, at least we have nice weather and we can celebrate it this week with the turning of the wheel a little bit more so I have set the intentions today for it to be involving fire inspiration health and healing increasing things in your life giving you empowerment and giving you guidance from the sun gods and goddesses first we're gonna start with the fire aspect and here I want to focus on the strength of it the power that fire has the quickness it brings everything it can bring warmth but it can also bring destruction it's a really fast moving energy which is overall the theme of our summer as soon as we started everything the energies have been moving really quickly whatever it is that you need right now the fire energy will provide it for you of a support here with this carnelian crystal also more known as a action crystal gives you a lot of confidence, support and strength kind of really goes well with this fire theme energy going on
next we are moving on to the inspiration part now that the summer vacations are really really close you might want to get back into your hobbies or give more time to your hobbies and if you're in a creative space where you like to do them sometimes it can get difficult during our break now that we have time like what am i supposed to create like what what, what should i even do now with all this free time so it's not only inspiration for creative hobbies but even inspiration what to do with your life your life purpose maybe you want to change a few things up and you will hit be hit by the inspiration thought thunder lightning kind of like this feeling of oh my god i know exactly what i need right now what i want to do what i should do what could light me up inside right now that's also a really big theme for the starting of summer i noticed it recently this week especially with so many different ideas for new videos popping up even though i already have like a list that has videos planned for over the next five six years <laughs> so you know sometimes that random thought that provokes another idea and another idea and then another idea maybe you even don't have any vacation planned and you will be hit with the thought oh my god i could visit this place i always wanted to go there but I never had time so now you have the time and the inspiration to plan this little trip shortly raise your vibration to align you with your creative self so it's a little bit easier for you to tap into the energy that you need whenever you need a little bit of inspiration next is health and here i want to set the intention that whatever it is that your body needs to improve for its health any healing that needs to cure that you can really really enjoy your summer will be happening right now 
your cells are gonna regenerate with ease. You will be making easier decisions regarding your health. If you're someone that neglects it a little bit because of other circumstances, it will be easier for you to shift it into your focus. Whatever is hindering you right now, physically or mentally, it's not going to be a struggle anymore because your body's natural regenerative system is going to be kind of like rebooted so that it's easier for your body to start its healing on its own since there's no more stress involved stress levels are going down your body can use the energy more for the important things I'm just gonna hear work through your whole energetic body If you have any specific health issues that you are aware about, you can shift your focus to that specific point so that Reiki will be led directly there. Moving to the empowerment part with this beautiful citrine to help you in that transformation so that you won't forget what kind of cool and badass person you are that can tackle anything, no task or project is too big for you.
Next, we're gonna use the key point increase. And here we have such a huge variety we can choose from increase of happiness, health, abundance, prosperity, money, opportunities, creativity. It's endless the list, what I'm trying to say. So feel free here to set your individual intention, what you wish for this summer solstice to bring you, to be more in, in, a, in focus, more like your tunnel vision, like we're gonna just go directly to that this summer, whatever it is that you really really want to do or change so so sorry just had the helicopter passing right above the building so I just had to wait <laughs> a little bit until it's gone when it's tiny little things like that where it's short I gladly wait a little bit out until it's the sound is gone Gonna hear as well raise your vibration so you're aligned with your most magnetic summer self. Everyone is always looking forward to summer, and I feel like because that's because since everyone's already so excited for it, summer vacation trips and everything, the energy is so high that automatically the whole timeline shifts you have a really huge energetic shift so just gonna match your energy to that frequency we're currently experiencing for some of you maybe even your throat chakra will randomly open up, you're gonna be really communicate co see communicative there we go, I don't know it always happens when I get channeled messages from other people that randomly my throat chakra just kind of like blocks and opens up again because I usually don't have a problem with speaking or like speaking up I mean, I literally do this as a job in front of a camera but some of you probably have an issue or like you struggle with that and I'm getting right now the download for some of you midsummer, July for some of you that may stop there Something is gonna happen for some of you. I don't know what it is. Huh. Really random. I usually don't get channel messages when I'm doing Reiki for other people. So someone's guides must have been really, really persisting with that person and you have 
may have been ignoring the signs. <laughs> Maybe that's why they just came strongly through. They were like, pass this message now, please. There we go. Next is Sun God and Goddess's energy. So, obviously everyone that celebrates uh, holidays like this, Sabbath, is really gonna focus on the energy of this holiday and they're gonna pray, venerate a lot of the goddesses and gods of the sun. So I'm gonna call upon the energy of every sun goddess and god in any culture, whatever you work with, whatever you believe in, whatever calls out to you. Um, let the energy of these divine beings guide my collective towards really really good decisions during the summer especially if they're struggling and they don't know where they want to go in the path highlight the way with the beautiful sun energy for them so that you will always be stirred in the right direction And may you find whatever you need for this summer thanks to the energy of these divine beings. May you be protected, may you be safe during your little adventures. May you always find the answers that you need after watching this video to move you forward along your path I'm gonna channel the energy of these divine beings to one big, big, big sphere of golden yellow light. Just gonna pull this right above. And send it your way. So you may have the clarity that you have been wishing for, maybe even get the divine messages you were meant to receive to guide you along the path, as well as help support every intention we have used so far in this video with the strength and power that they just accumulated in this little ball of light and if you are someone that has psychic abilities I actually challenge you is that the correct word? to really visualize and see the light And it even holding your hand out like this and kind of like taking it to you and harness that energy for you so 
now that you have that energy we're gonna finish with an hour of love so you're ready to go celebrate today's events i'm gonna upload this video tomorrow so that you can use the energy directly on the day of the holiday I would love to hear how you're gonna celebrate in case you celebrate I hope you enjoyed this session I thank you so so much for letting me do this for you and be part of your weekly practice and I'm excited to see you in our next session for next week until then I hope everyone stay safe and healthy and I will see you then goodbye everyone